And with that, we end uh, this transmission for The Open University. This is BBC Two. Hello again. Very good afternoon to you. Well, this is where we commence our Rock Week here on Two, a celebration of rock music past and present. During the coming week, we'll be showing a series of major films reflecting vintage and contemporary stars, ranging from Bill Haley in Rock, Rock, Rock and Stardust with David Essex to The Beatles' Yellow Submarine, as well as a series of major concerts by and profiles of artists such as Police, Joan Armour Trading, The Band, Genesis, The Specials, The jam and others. But it's with rock and roll's great innovator that we begin as the king. Elvis Presley stars in G.I. Blues. Well, another of the, the great uh, legends of rock music, Jimi Hendrix continues our rock week here on two at 6.45 with a film that captures him performing from his early club dates right through to Woodstock. There's also an appreciation of his work from artists such as uh, Mick Jagger, Eric Clapton and Pete Townsend. That's at 6.45 tonight. And at 9.15, David Essex and Ringo Starr feature in the movie That'll Be The Day. Other highlights of Rock Week include Maze, recorded live in concert in New Orleans tomorrow evening at five past eight, and later tomorrow at ten o'clock, the movie Tommy, with stereo sound on Radio One. There's a major rock presentation every day for the next week here on Two. On Monday afternoon, for instance, we offer some tasty bank holiday rock, nearly three and a half hours of rock and roll, starting at one with Elvis in Jailhouse Rock, followed by the specials in concert, a documentary on Mick Fleetwood's visit to Ghana, and then Genesis in concert. Certainly all rocking here on Two. Now it's time for test cricket as we join Jim Laker and the team at Headingley. And welcome back here to uh, Headingley, where Pakistan are 169 for eight. Imran Khan is still there on 26, and has just been joined by new batsman Sikander. A stubborn uh, eighth wicket stand there with Abdul Qadir ended just a few minutes ago. They added 41 before Jackman coming on for a new spell, bowled Qadir with his very first ball. This is the way it happened. Pitching just outside off stump, little inside edge, in fact, uh, from Kadir there, just to drag it onto the off stump. It's a deserved victim there for Robin Jackman, who's been toiling away for a long, long spell here. 